Oh, hey guys. Oh, I have been away for like four months doing what? Eating, sleeping, overthinking because what is life? But you guys, on a serious note, the reason I'm even making this video is to give you a life update of where I've been for the last four months. Because I think the last time I put a vlog up was in December, towards, towards the end of December. So guys, this is exactly what happened. So, December was late for me. Amazing vacation. I think I, I actually will link the videos down below in case you've not watched my Watamu vlogs. I have a couple of them. I have one swimming with the dolphins. I have one going for a doll night. Nikaza, you guys, you just have... Because in, in this corona quarantine situation, I bet you have the time to watch. So, January came. So my plan was, I was supposed to... I, I had planned to move out this year. So January, I was supposed to house hunt. This is what I had in my mind. I thought, I thought I'll house hunt for like a week. And then we could move into the new house. We could resettle. By the end of January, back to the vlog life. But Kumbe, that is not how it works. <laughs> so first house hunting is work. You guys, house hunting is work. I think... That should be a vlog on itself. So I ended up house hunting for the whole of January. Imagine, like a whole month. I wasn't getting anything I was liking. So, and I didn't want to settle because I kept feeling it's not I am. It's not like I am being rushed to move out. So there's no point of me settling for something else. So that is how my January went. So come February. I moved out finally. So I think January was spent settling in. You guys, <laughs> I did not even have the most basic stuff. So I think Feb was more of me like going to buy stuff, trying to get where I can get the cheapest, good quality stuff. And then in the middle of all that, my computer crashed. I know, like. When I'm just now geared up to get back to vlogging, my computer crashed. So the computer I was using was the slowest, most annoying computer I've ever, I've ever used. So obviously with that, I couldn't edit vlogs because, ah, like seriously, even loading a, a video would take me like an hour. And I say you see who edit, so I gave up. I, I just gave up. I was like, you know what? I'll just wait, get myself a computer, and then I can get back to this. And then also in the moving, one of my vlogging lights, Bunjikan. Oh. And you guys, I had not even used it. I had purchased it like a week or two, and then Kabunjika. So March came. One of the best things that happened is I got my dream computer, ha, which is so amazing. And then after that, Oh, Corona happened. Oh my God. And then I don't know why. When Corona was like started spreading to the world, honestly, I, I really got like bad anxiety. I just kept thinking, oh my God, this is how we die. Oh my God, this is how we die. This is how we die. This is how we die. And then I kept thinking, oh my God, this is how my friends will die. This is how the world will die. So in short, die, 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 die. And of course, when you're, when you're in a state where everything is like die, 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 there's no energy. There's no, there's nothing amazing about life. So obviously, I couldn't even pick up the camera. There were so many instances where I was like, oh, that could be nice for a vlog. But then I was like, ah. Sure, mm -mm. I don't think you have the energy. And no, also in you, fine, I would capture the footage, but editing, I was like, you know what, sure, live life, try to be positive, enjoy, enjoy being alive, because at the end of the day, at, at that point, I was really convinced this is how we all die of corona. So I'm like, you know what, you're going to take these videos, you're going to edit them, nobody will watch them because people will be dead that is how shallow and that's how much i had given up so much passed april happened which happens to be my birthday month by the way so april shockingly yeah so 
so no, I was really getting excited about life. My anxiety had really slowed down. I had just, I don't know, I, did, I think more research and watching TV like 24 7. I just realized, oh my god, I'm not gonna die of Corona. I mean, you you are not ideally supposed to die of Corona if, if at all you try keeping safe and i hope i do. i hope i don't make this video and die <laughs> oh god forbid right? so i just thought to myself oh my god i'm not gonna die of corona so my energy started coming back so energy merudi 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 until today when we are it's actually my birthday i woke up with so much energy I was like you know what pick up that camera sha do a live update Live today, I mean, who thought you would celebrate your 20 something birthday? So it's like, you know what, I took up the camera and here I am vlogging, wasting your time, keeping you company during quarantine because. Pff. And you guys, also, small, small update, I forgot. I cut my hair. I don't know. The reason I cut my hair, eh, that's another story, you guys. I feel like my life is full of stories, <laughs> but it's okay. So what happened is, I, I think I've been natural for such a long time, for over, over like three years. And I, I had amazing, well, not I had, I have amazing hair. When I get with natural hair, it figures a point you get tired. Like I was tired, seriously. So I thought, ah, why not shave my hair and start all over again? And then guess what? I thought, ah, before I shave. So textualize it. See this whole thing people keep saying at it. Oh, no, no, no. Don't textualize your natural hair. I was like, you know what? Shadow it. So I textualized my hair. Two, three days, I was in love. Day four, five, I hated it. But I knew my end plan was to cut my hair short. So I was like, you know what? Walked into a barber shop and then I was like, ah, just cut, just cut this whole thing off. So that's how I got to cut my hair. And you guys, now that I'm on quarantine and have all the time in the world, I'm wishing I had my hair so that I can like do twist out. For you naturalistas, you know, like your hair can legit keep you company. <laughs> so now the fact that I, I can do nothing on my hair sucks. Can't wait for it to grow. I'm still not, I've not even started doing like the natural hair routines because I, I still feel like it's kadogo. Starts to start pimping it and too much stress on it or oh, so i just i just wake up and live like this so guys i think i think i've not left anything out on my life updates mm, yeah i think i have not so guys that is where i am at um how do i spend my day that is i enrolled for online classes i'm on skillshare which i'm loving i mean it has it has enough it has enough for, to keep me busy during the quarantine period so when i'm not working i'm on my online classes and now i will be on vlogs and yeah that's basically my life now i think i want to do a house tour oh no this is how i'll do i'll first do a vlog on house hunting and then, because you guys, when I tell you it's an, a vlog by itself, it is a vlog by itself. And then I'll do a house tour. And then we will know. From there, we will we will come up with another vlog. But for now, guys, thank you for watching. Thank you for allowing me to waste your time. Please remember, please remember to subscribe, like, and share. Gives it a thumbs up. And I love you guys. Please stay safe. Take all the precautions we have been told to do. I love you guys.